think that the, it's very fun to play with in the gay gay scene because they give and with gay people are I think a little bit more proud than or modig. Um, brave. brave. They're, they're brave because they've been working with themselves. Maybe they've talked to their families, talking to themselves. Who am I? Do I like girls? Do I like men? Do I like... And I think that they're more brave that, than average people. So they kind of like live. When you live, you live. You get your life and you need to, to live for the day. So that's why it's so impressive with, with the brave gay scene that they just don't give a beep. Mm -hmm. They just live and this screw if they have a pink cat or a boa. They just love loves to live now and 100%. And that's what we ordinary people should be inspired of. So that's they just kind of like this. The lightness, yeah, happy and like the music growth. and the happy, mm -hmm. the scene. We we fit very well. <laughs> See? <laughs> See, you laugh. Yeah, <laughs> and you love. And you love a little. Yeah. I, my parents have uh, always <laughs> known it since they put a pink dress on me. No, uh, not a dress. I mean, uh, I had this when I was two years old. There's a picture of me when I have a pink. Skirt? No skirts. Oh. No, like uh, a, when you. Suit. A cat suit? Already <laughs> two years old. I had a pink <laughs> cat <laughs> suit. <laughs> no, but you know, when you're a baby, you have all the. Spark yeah, like a Yeah, a body. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that was not. Th that was their choice. But no, uh, they were actually. They've been. No, there has, has not been any negative or they've just, I said, I, I'm gay. They're like, okay, pass the salt, kind of like that. It wasn't any... You're lucky. Yeah, I'm lucky. Yeah. I've, I have a very, that's why I think I've also been felt very secure with my sexuality and everything. It hasn't been a secret or anything for, n never, I think, no. Not with my friends since I was very, very young. But then to the public, I came out later, of course, because I wasn't really feel. I didn't want to talk about it back then, but that's like 10, 11 years ago, so I'm, I'm okay. I, I've, uh, we, I've talked about this first time for like, uh, what, what? In December. December last November, year. December last year. Last year, so a year, almost a year and a half now. So it, it wasn't a new thing, not in Sweden, but uh, here in Germany, of course. You don't know. No, nothing, nothing. I feel I'm, I'm doing great, and I can do everything as everybody else does. And I'm, I have a boyfriend, and of course you have to be careful in other, you know. But in everyday life, there's no problem. That's why I wanted to share as well with other people who doesn't know about it that much because you don't talk about it so much still, which is stupid, I think. That it, there is no problem, you can be... I think people have a picture of HIV people being very, very sick, you know, and skinny, and that's the old 80, 1980s stuff, but you know, you can live your whole life. I'm going to live just as long as you uh, other guys who doesn't have it. So, and that's what I want to inspire people and, and yeah let people to know so I think you should test yourself even though you're practicing safe sex or not you know regularly um, if you are if, if you think maybe that you might yeah well it can actually it can happen one the first time you have sex so it doesn't matter I think you everyone should test yourself even though if you're in maybe in a relationship because I know this stories about this couples who's been together for 10 years and the man has been unfaithful and gave the, the woman HIV. But she didn't know, of course, and he didn't think it. And they, she had it for almost 10 years and it was almost too late before she got her medicine and treatment, which is horrible. If it, You don't want it to be like that. Mm. So I think everybody should test it. It should be an everyday, no, everyday thing. <laughs> no, but like when you go and you check your health and everything, you, mm. ch you check for... You, uh, women check their breasts for cancer and, and you should do an HIV test, it's nothing, no big deal, it's just a spruta, mm -hmm. just a shot, mm -hmm. you know. 
uh, do a big summer tour in Sweden. We're going to travel around Sweden to different kind of festivals. And then we will be a lot here, yeah. down in Germany. We I think we have... Many. Many gigs here, yeah. yeah. Both TV shows and sh shows. Radio gigs and club gigs. Yeah. <laughs> www.alcazarworld.de Because we don't the German. know the dates. No. no. But, they, it's on the, the web but we will be back in yeah. Germany. We know that. Absolutely. Absolutely. We know. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, we're Alcazar, Alcazar and you're watching Yagalu. Yaga